Dear students, assalamu alaikum. I am hopeful that you would be safe and sound inside your homes. Dear students, since long you are connected to us through this digital platform, and a digital platform is never substitution for actual classroom teaching. But from 21st of September 2020, the partial mode of physical classroom teaching has begun or uh, has resumed. You must come to the school to receive the things from your teachers, also the guiding, guidance and the counseling so that you can crack the coming examinations with ease. The board has JK Bose is well set to conduct your examinations after 15th of November for which it, the board has issued the notification. But date sheet for the class 10th and 12th is yet to come. Dear students, you met with huge losses, no doubt, but in order to compensate these losses, what we need to do, we have to put extra efforts, we have to do extra hard work to crack the coming examinations with ease. Dear students, the substitution for hard work can't be there and for the self-study can't be there. There is no available substitution for the hard work and the self-study because the self-study and hard work that can take one sinking vote to the bank. Their students, the pandemic days are very are very worse days, miserable days. It is putting life at stake, economy activities are at, um, are shut, partially they are going and partially they are shut and fear of COVID-19 is everywhere, it's scary seen um, on every face. Better is to um, follow guidelines so that you can save your lives first. There are students of class 10th to 12th. Yesterday uh, at uh, about 9 p.m. I was uh, reading a book in my room, a student from Sirajpur asked me or requested me to make me learn the negative and intranegative of past simple tense. Past simple tense. Exactly this is asked in the board examinations of class 12th and class 10th sometimes. So it is very important how to make negative and intragative of past simple tense. First of all, you need to know what is past simple tense, how, how it can be constructed. Dear students, past simple tense is a tense in which you find the second form of the verb. For example, take a single verb, play. The second form is played, third form is played, and its ing form is playing. Or it is first form that is present is play, past is played, past participle is played, and present participle is playing. A tense in which you find the second form of verb is past simple. Take another example. Take an example. I went to school. I went to school. Went to the second form of verb. So it is past simple. I bought a pen yesterday. Bought the second form of the verb. So it is the past simple. Dear students, now question arises. How we can make negative and interrogative of past simple tense or we can say past simple sentence. First of all, you need to know that past simple tense is a tense which is used to narrate past story or to describe past event. For example, India became free in 1947, became in the second form of the verb and India's freedom on August 15, 1947 is a past event. So in past simple we describe events, past events, or we narrate past story. Take another example, World War II culminated in 1945. Culminated is the second form of the verb, so it is past simple and it is also past event. Take another example, Sri Lanka became free in 1948. So, became is the second form of verb. So, in past simple, we narrate past story. For example, on 20... 20th of February 9, 2019, I was at Delhi. After remaining in Delhi, after I remained at Delhi for uh, about one month, then I went to Mumbai. And after Mumbai, I went to I went to Goa. And after Goa, I went to the West Bengal. So the past simple event uh, went to I am using many a times. So it is. I am narrating past story in 
what past sample now question arises how we can make it is negative and interrogative this this is the topic i played hockey take an example i played hockey it is what past sample because second form of verb is there but it means also i did play hockey when there is did this first form of verb and when there is a second form of verb there is no did so i did play hockey is same as i played hockey because present of do and does is did so i played hockey is i did play hockey i did not play hockey is negative and did i play is this did i play hockey is interrogative interrogative sentences are those sentences in which questions are asked and interrogative sentences and with a question mark take another example rashid caught a board rashid caught a board caught is the second form of verb it means rashid did catch a ball did catch a board rashid did catch a ball Rashid did not catch a word. Negative means is a declaration where you find deny or where you denial of the things or where not is used. So Rashid did not catch a word. Did Rashid catch a word? It's interrogative. So simple. In present simple, do and does works. And in present simple, before the first form of verb with I, you, and plural, there is do working. And with the singular, there is does working, and there is does working both. Uh, past of both, that is do and does is did. So when there is a did, there is a first form of verb. It's past simple. When there is no did, it's the second form of verb. There is past simple. But with the second form of verb, without using the did, you can't make the negative and interrogative of past simple. You have to keep it in the mind. Let students take an example. Rashid went to Sri Nagar. Rashid went to Sri Nagar. When is the second form of verb with went to? You can't make it negative and interrogative. It means Rashid did go to Sri Nagar. Rashid did go to Sri. When there is did, there is a first form of verb. When there is not did, there is a second form of the verb. Rashid went to Sri Nagar means Rashid did go to Sri Nagar. Rashid did not go to Sri Nagar. Did Rashid go to Sri Nagar? It is interrogative. Take another example. Kareem met. The lion in the forests. The Kareem Kareem met the lion in the forests. With met, second form of the verb. It's past simple. You can't make what negative and it's interrogative. That means Kareem did meet. Kareem did meet lion. The lion in the forests. Kareem did not meet. Did not meet lion in the forests. Did Kareem meet lion in the forest? This is interrogative. So you have to keep in the mind that in past simple there is second form of the verb and when with the second form of verb you can't form negative and interrogative and did when you insert did there did with the first form it's also past sample and with did you can form negative and interrogative dear students remember past simple tense is a simple tense in which the second form of verb is used and it is used to narrate past story or past event take one more example you will get it clearly Rashid brought a pen. Rashid brought a pen. Brought is the second form of verb. It's past simple. With brought, you can't make negative and interrogative. This means Rashid did bring a pen. Rashid did bring. When there is did, there is first form of. Rashid did not bring a pen. Did Rashid bring a pen? Dear students, hope you you might have grasped the concept. This is how we can make negative and interrogative of past simple tenses. Better is to see these things on your available English book. That is the grammar book. If any sort of confusion or query may strike your mind, after watching this video, you can call me. My number is already in your possession. I am around the clock available for you, or we can say at at your disposal because I am a teacher getting handsome amount of salary from the state exchequer. Thanks. Be well, asset.